god, this is so cool. I'm gonna build other big ships. Hey guys, welcome to Crawl's Workshop for some more Trail Makers, but this time we're in space. The Space Bound update came out yesterday, and so as soon as I came back from work, I just had to hop on and start building a ship. I won't take too long guys, but I'd like to share a bit of my history with space games. I've played Space Engineers before, and then Interstellar Rifts, and Starbase, among others. Now all three of the games I mentioned allow you to build your own spaceships and I absolutely love doing that. I used to cover those games on my main channel as well but that channel evolved into a dinosaur game channel so I can't really cover those games on there anymore which is why I created this channel right here. So now having the chance to be in space again and having the ability to build a spaceship to me feels like I get to scratch an itch that's been bugging me for years but I just couldn't reach it until now. So now that you guys are all caught up on that, I decided to go for a huge ship just because we've already seen Scrapman and UZ and their friends build small fighters, but so far I haven't seen anyone take on a big ship project. So let me be the first to take this on, or at least one of the first since I haven't seen anyone else try it. So with all that out of the way, let's start building. I want to know, can I build like a cruiser size ship can i build something huge i want to know i want to be the first one to try <laughs> at least the first one to post it on youtube everybody is just taking on small projects so let's see
I only just realized there's a maximum complexity. Like I was, I was on a roll here. Like I, I could see this ship starting to take shape, and uh, I was really excited for this. But now, now I'm realizing the game doesn't like big vehicles. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be able to limit this build to 700.
Let's just say doesn't control as I would like. I think part of the reason is because my seat still has... Okay, so disable, disable. Disabled my seat controls. So now my seat should not interfere with my controls at all. Uh, I'm also going to need some quantum rudders. Uh, where are those? Yeah, they're right here. Okay, so let's uh, just just for the sake of trying it. I don't think I want to use keys for those. Let's just see what they do. I'm using these to control. So I can't use space and shift for pitch. You guys are going to use forward like that. And then same for these guys. Oh, I can't look around with my mouse anymore. Now this is working way better. Okay, I need to re-enable the look around. But I, I don't want air controls though, so... Okay, now I can look around. Okay, I can roll. That's good. Perfect. I'm just... I'm just moving at that speed forever. kind of slowing me down but it's taking forever maybe i need more quantum rudders to really slow me down
I just realized my my thrusters in the front of the ship they're uh they're inverted now they're gonna shoot the right way because i wanted to use those for braking so that that should be reversed now yeah and, oh did not want to do that but I forgot I have my uh, <laughs> my little antenna just for looks but yeah I can I can start it spinning and I can stop it I feel like it's spinning a bit too fast to be uh, it's not quite the effect I was looking for so I might slow it down and there's something else I want to do is there any way that I can modify this to put one of these here maybe I, I prefer these thrusters over the uh, the space ones. I think that looks better. Put that one there. That looks good. I think it looks good. I mean, for a... Ve it's my first ship that I build in this game. Huh, kind of like that. Yeah, I like it. I would put so much more detail on this thing if if the limit wasn't so... Like, if the limit wasn't 700, I would add so many more things to this thing. It would be closed up everywhere, and there would be so much more detail. I'm quite happy with the result. So, how about now we go and try it out in a fight? Oh, there's pirates right there. Let's go there. Pretty sure I am about to get killed there.
another one down. I'm still alive. I don't want to repair it because I feel like that's cheating. I... It definitely feels like I'm fighting using a huge cargo ship. It feels so heavy, but it's great. It's great because it's supposed to be a heavy ship. I just, I don't know. There's probably ways that I could make my ship more maneuverable. big ships i think that's probably what i'm gonna be specializing in eventually i'm probably gonna build one that's gonna feel really good this is my first one so i can't expect too much craziness change direction <laughs> there's so many controls on that thing so just to give you guys an idea if i want to yaw it's a and d so right and left it's a and d if i want to move my turrets to the right it's the three key because i couldn't find a key that would make it fit i can't use my mouse keys the only one that it's going to work is the 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 left mouse button so i need to actually since i want to use my turrets i should probably use the left mouse button to fire instead of the so yeah i want to turn it to the right it's three and then i want to fire it's two but then when i use my left hand in those keys i can't use my my same fingers to to pitch and yaw or to so I need to kind of like let it drift and then turn the turrets. It's making it so hard to control. But despite all that, I mean, I, I won three or four fights before I died. I'm, I'm still happy for a first ship, but I wish they would let us map out, like use the mouse keys. Cause I have, I have so many mouse buttons on my mouse. I have a gaming mouse. I have one, two, three, 
or five buttons that I could use that I could map to control stuff on my ship, but the game won't let me. It's only letting me use the left mouse button. That's it. And then I can't map F. I can't map C. I can't map Z. So it's so tough to map several controls like I do, like I have with this ship. It's so hard. But despite all that, it's still a very cool ship. Still a very cool game. All right, guys, that's going to be the end for this video. But I hope you all enjoyed watching this big ship take shape. Now, I can already think of a few ways to optimize it and make it better. So I will more than likely post an update video to show any improvements I make to it in the very near future. So that's all for now. Share your thoughts in the comments. All feedback is welcome. You guys take care and I will see you all soon. Bye bye.